Hi, in this video we're going to show you a tool you could use to access your Linux hard drives on your Windows computer. So let's say you have a dual boot system or maybe you have a Linux hard drive from another computer and you want to get some data off it. Uh, you could attach it to your Windows computer and use this program to do so. So it's called Linux File Systems for Windows by Paragon Software. So here's what it supports. versions of Windows and here's the supported file systems EXT2, 3, and 4 for read and write and then for read only BTRFS and XFS. So they have a free trial and then if you want to buy it most likely for home use it's only $30 so it's not a bad deal. Alright so we're going to try it out on this computer here so right now we just have the C drive and the F drive which are Windows drives here and TFS and if I go into disk management, I have this 50 gig disk here, which is a Linux disk. So there's no drive letter. I can't do anything with it. Doesn't show up here. All right, so we're going to install the software. Okay, there's a checkbox here to add the environment variable path. So leave that checked. You could change the directory. Uh, you could do just for this user or all users. Okay, so we're going to restart the computer real quick. I've used this before and I didn't have to restart, but we'll go ahead and reboot just to uh, Make sure we did everything correctly here, so we'll be right back for that. Okay, so we've rebooted, so let's try it out. Alright, so it found the drive and actually mounted it for us. And gave it the drive letter E, so it's EXT4, MBR, mounted. So here's how much space is used. Mount automatically is enabled. Read write mode enabled. We have some options here to open a file explorer. Then we have some settings for the program here. For mount automatically. Check for updates. Show the log. Restart the service. So if you add a new drive and it's not finding it, you could try to restart the service to see if it finds it. I check for updates. Create volume dump file, format the drive, and so on. All right, so let's go into File Explorer and see what we have here. Okay, so here's our E drive, the 50 gigs. And we can see our file system here. Like so, let's try and make a new file here, or new folder actually, just like that. And then when you're done, let's close this. There's also a verify option too if you want to check out the volume, so we just unmount it. And now it's gone from there. Okay, so as you can see, it's pretty easy to use and does a good job here. So I will put a link in the description where you could download Linux file systems for Windows, and then you could try it out for yourself. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.